The release of iOS 8 has brought numerous new features for iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch devices. One area that saw improvement was the web browser. I'm Dan Graziano, and in today's how-to, I'm going to show you some of the new features Apple added to its Safari web browser. There's no longer a need to worry if you accidentally close a tab. Previous versions of iOS allowed iPad users to open recently closed tabs, and with iOS 8, this feature is now available on the iPhone. In the browser, select the tab button at the bottom right hand corner of the screen, then long press on the plus sign. After a couple of seconds, a list of recently closed tabs will show up. Simply select one to relaunch the tab. For the first time, Apple has included the ability to force mobile Safari to load the desktop version of a website. This is a cool feature, but it's somewhat hidden. When viewing a site in Safari, tap the address bar to bring up a thumbnail grid of your favorite sites. Next, use a downward gesture, revealing two hidden buttons. The first will add the current site to your favorites, while the second button will force the page to reload the desktop version. And lastly, if you're not a fan of Google, Yahoo, or Microsoft tracking your search history, there's some good news. Apple has added the privacy-focused search engine DuckDuckGo to the official list of approved Safari search providers. To change the default search engine, head into Settings, click on Safari, and select Search Engine. You will notice DuckDuckGo at the bottom of the list. Select it, back out of the settings app, and start searching the web in complete privacy. For more tips and tricks like these, be sure to check out howto.cnet.com. You can also reach out to me on Twitter with any questions or comments. I'm Dan Graziak for CNET. Thanks for watching.